hey guys, it's quote unquote your boy, Ballface8020, back again with another great response video. Um, I just found this video of Casey. This is from like way back, from like this around Christmas time of 2018. And, you know, there's nothing really interesting about it, but I just wanted to show it to you guys to just show you that there was apparently a pre-Red Pill Casey, like beyond the one that we just heard about, like in of him in high school, like, you know, where he was also, where instead of doing manosphere stuff, he was doing fitness coaching. And it's just weird to see how different he is. So let's check it out and uh, see what he has to say here. Oh, shit. Oops. My fitness programming and one of the girls that I coach right now, She's week six out of 16 into coaching with me. And this is what she just put up on Facebook right here. This is like super cool. It's almost a total body transformation in like six weeks. I mean, she's on track to just killing it. Wow. So he's so much more relaxed. He's uh, coaching a woman. So he's actually coaching and he's not just talking of spurging about masculinity and He's actually like a tiny bit likable, which is, you know, very unusual for him. I'm super excited to see what she looks like. I, I mean, she still has 10 weeks of coaching left, so by the time she's done, I can't even imagine. I mean, that's crazy already. It's recording. All right, so whoever has been blowing up the comment section saying they need more arm wrestling videos, I'm just going to prove that probably no matter how much I keep lifting, it's going to be a long ways before I can handle this. <laughs> but we'll give her a whirl. All right, Kenzie. <laughs> Go ahead. Hold on. All right, slide over that one. All right, Kenzie, you get to say go. Three, two, one, go. <laughs> All right, go left. Go left. Okay. Three, two, one, go. <laughs> it's so fast. Is it actually that easy? Yeah, it's that easy. I literally, I literally cannot beat him at all. All right. Okay, I just wanted to show that whole scene, to like show you some dynamic with his family, with his sister. So apparently that black haired girl in the video is actually not his sister. It's some other girl. I don't know who she is. The uh, That's his sister who you saw there. But like you seeing him act like, like a normal person, like a normal young guy, like with his family. Now his dad seems like a douche. So that's probably where he got it from. Uh, also, you know, just to point it out, you know, you see him next to his dad who who's like a legit big guy. You see that like Casey is, you know, we think of like Casey, I think of Casey as like a guy who maybe he's not very tall but he's got a big frame he really doesn't he has an average frame and he's you know so well you know he's developed himself so well in the gym that it makes it look like a bigger frame and he's really good about wearing you know clothes that you know are uh you know fit with his shape and stuff so i'm not no hate on casey's looks he's a really especially here in this video i guess he's kind of hitting the wall now and you see he's really really a good looking guy and um but like you know in terms of like body type he's pretty average you know about average height average frame he's just got a gym body um you know like when you get you see his, his dad though is like a legit big guy um uh, his dad seems like a total tool and i maybe that's like part of the problem casey because casey never talks about his mom i know he sounds like he's still close with his dad so I, I i don't maybe his mom's just legit insane i don't know but anyway i mean the main reason i just made this i just wanted to show you guys what he used to be like and, um, you know, people, people can change and get weird for any reason, you know, so I mean, maybe there's other shit that went on with Casey, I don't know. But the thing is, the only thing we know that changed between this video and the Casey we see today is that he got red pilled. It could have been, it, maybe for all we know, maybe something happened that made him want to get red pilled. But it, from all, it sounds like he's still close with his family and stuff. So I think he just you know, he just went down the red pill rabbit hole and it really ended up fucking with his mind because, you know, you see he's a much happier guy here. And imagine if this is the Casey that Brittany had been in a relationship with, how happy they would be together. And, um, you know, like that really, it could have, it could have worked out. And, you know, so, I mean, look, I mainly, I just, you know, bash, I'm, I'm not going to say I'm like some kind of hero here. My channel doesn't have a lot of reach. But even if it did have a lot of reach, it wouldn't like the reason I make fun of the red pill or not even make, make fun of and critique the red pill is because just because it's something to do. It's it's fun. I don't take it that seriously. 
but you can see it really does like i said it hurts men like i mean the the red pill has it seems to me from watching the red pill has stolen casey zander's life and i mean how many other victims has this left in its wake so just say no to the red pill kids that's all for now and i'll see you in the next